Here's a quick answer you're looking for. The YouTube upload limit is 256 gigabytes or 12 hours, whichever you hit first. But that's only if your account is verified. If you wanna learn more about verifying your account, how to make sure your video is under the file size limit and how many videos in total you can upload a day, then keep watching. What's up? I'm Joey Dow, creator of New Territory Media. So let's say you wanna upload several hours of footage all at once. Now, as I mentioned at the top of this video, the upload limit is 12 hours or 256 gigabytes, whichever you hit first. Both of those numbers are really big and you should have no worries about hitting that limit. If you've seen a video longer than 12 hours, that's because YouTube added the upload limit more recently, so those old videos are grandfathered in. The 12 hour or 256 gigabyte limit only applies to verified accounts though. Unverified accounts have a much shorter 15 minute limit. Now, verified does not mean that you're in the YouTube partner program or are monetizing your account. It's just a very basic cell phone verification. Here's how you do it. To verify your account, go to youtube.com slash verify, enter your phone number, type in the code they send you, and you're good to go. If you're not sure if you've already done the verification before, no problem, just go to this URL. It is youtube.com slash account underscore features, and you can check it out. If it says enabled, that means you're verified. You can find both of these links in the description below. Now, what if your account is verified, but you want to upload a video that's bigger than 256 gigabytes? Maybe you shot in glorious ProRes 4444 at 4K, and now you have a huge, massive file. Well, you're going to need to compress the file before uploading to YouTube. Handbrake is a free compression program that works really well. There are also other ways to compress files depending on what editing program you're using. Most of these editing programs have a built-in paired compressor or the ability to compress the files themselves. Also, if you shot something that is over 256 gigabytes and you shot in ProRes and you're familiar with ProRes, then you should probably be familiar with these tools. Uh, but just in case you you're not, besides Handbrake, we've got Apple Compressor. If you're using Final Cut, you most likely have Apple Compressor. And if you're using Adobe, we've got Adobe Media Encoder. And also Resolve can pretty much do this built in. You just adjust your settings to compress the file, looking for that sweet balance of getting the file size down, but not compressing the footage so much that you lose quality in your footage. Also, the other factor that comes into play is what your internet upload speed is. If you have slow internet, 256 gigabytes is gonna take a long time. Even a couple gigabytes, depending on your internet connection, will take a long time. So you wanna get that file compressed. 99% of the cases, you're gonna be nowhere near 256 gigabytes. If you are, I'd love to know what you uploaded that was that big. So a lot of these editing programs, they have built-in presets so you can just pick an option from the best one that supports what type of footage you shot in and what kind of quality you want to get out of it. It will usually be something using the H.264 compressor which makes the file sizes a lot smaller, but still maintains really good quality. Also remember, YouTube is going to add its own compression. So you do want to pick the highest quality source that you can in sense of file size is manageable, file size can be uploaded because YouTube's also going to add its extra compression on top of it. So you need to find that sweet balance of what works and what's best for you. Also, if you do use Premiere, we have an article that covers a lot of settings, the best settings that you can use for getting the smallest file size and for getting the highest quality video out of Adobe Premiere. So check out that article linked in the description below. Now, let's say you wanna upload multiple videos in a single day. Maybe you're using your YouTube channel as a portfolio or you wanna upload a bunch of stock footage clips that you're gonna sell. Is there a limit to the number of videos that you can upload in a single day? Well, there is no official documentation from YouTube saying whether there is or is not a limit, but according to people on Quora and other online forums, the consensus is the limit is 15 videos a day. However, some people have said that they were able to upload 100 videos a day. So if you've got a lot of clips to upload, you're kind of gonna be on your own to test that out, but you should be safe as long as your numbers are under 15. All right, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to the channel. Also check out our other videos, whatever YouTube recommends. That's gonna pop up next to my head right here. If you have any other questions about YouTube upload limits or YouTube in general, let me know in the comments below and I'll see you in the next episode.